Hey everybody, it's Jersey Gamer 9000. Welcome back to more Super Mario Galaxy. So in the last episode, we were able to complete everything that involved the terrace. We did the Hungry Luma outside the terrace. We got the Grand Star from Bowser Jr.'s robot. And we were able to open the fountain. Which enables us to head now to Space Junk Galaxy, which should be our next galaxy that we're going to do. So here we go, let's fly! So, mission one in Space Junk Galaxy. Pull Star Path, here we go. Now this galaxy is pr pre um well there's not much ground let's just say that so you gotta pull yourself to pretty much one spot to another consider the path you know pull you know star pull path galaxy you know or yeah anyway I yeah so you pretty much gotta take one pull star to the next you don't have to go to everyone just you know until you actually get a hold of one. Oh, I almost lost it there. Just like flip the controller to to lose the the pull star. It will. Hope once you're close enough, you'll head to the next area. So don't worry about getting pulled back. So now, obviously, we're collecting star chips here. This will be our launch star. And we'll head to the next area. Not that, but we'll, well, we will head on there later. And and bound over here. Alright. So we're on like a strange... We're on like, it seems like it'd be a familiar ship. But we're not gonna worry about that right now. Alright. These star bits keep coming. Where's... There it is. Find these two look... Mm, balls of... Hey! These two looking ball things that have pole stars in them. That's actually three of them, but we're not gonna get into that right now. Can I get over there, please? Thanks. And then I guess we'll just pull ourselves over here. Follow the path. Up there, head over here, get those star bits. And we'll head up here. Okay, just completely ignore these guys. They're... Unless you want some star bits. That's always good, though. So it's good to get some star bits. Sometimes I think I get too much. Now we have to do is free, free all these toads that are frozen these crystals. The Toad Brigade, as they're called. Freeing them all will bring the captain down. Hey, oh, well, I guess I'm up here. Didn't mean for that to happen. I wanted to cook the Goomba. But anyway, we'll just sling star our way to where we need to go. Okay, so now this mission is going to introduce the silver stars in the bubble. So as you go, platforms will appear and disappear depending on where you are. So what we have to do is pretty much collect these uh, silver stars and just fire them all together. Now I haven't done this enough to know where, when things will appear, so I'm just gonna follow the path. And I think the path I'm taking is probably the quickest way to do this. Because you want the last one you get to be this one. Um, and you'll see why in probably the next video, when we have to redo it. Because of certain circumstances, it's gonna happen to this galaxy. But we'll worry about that later. Let's see if I can series break to that area. Oh, I can! Wow, I didn't think that was possible. It would have been funny if I died there. But whatever, we got the power star. Which is good, because we needed to get a power star. And now we have 12. And we discovered a new galaxy, which happens to be in the fountain. Which is always good. Let's go up! Okay. So let's head back to Space Junk. Ooh. 
and do mission number two. Camilla's airship attack. So this is sort of like the mini boss of this galaxy. And it has one of the best Bowser music ever. So let's head up. Alright, break these boxes. We got a Goomba! You gotta love Goombas, man. All they do is worship Bowser and all they do is die. Of course, these Goombas give us star bits, so that's always good. Okay, hit this switch, excuse me, to knock that bridge down. Let's see if there's anything up here first. There's a block. Those star bits, let's see if there's anything over here. Excuse me. I'm not gonna risk anything over there. Okay, so let's head over here. Now we have these bunnies that are demonstrating something. That if you do... Uh, oh! That bunny almost killed me! That if you jump and spin, you can go further with moments like that. Or you can do the long jump. And then, that yellow one is showing that if you jump straight up and spin, you'll go a little higher. Breaking that crate, I don't know how breaking crates appear as sling stars, but yeah. And then just to spin on that little switch and you'll get that. Ooh, ooh, star bits, star bits, and I accidentally spun there, but I got the box and which revealed some star bits. Let's free these toads, we don't want them to feel it, you know. Hit the treasure chest with a shell. Alright, let's do that. One of these will reveal star bits. I think the other one will reveal a coin. Yep. But that's not the one we want. What you want is that launch star. Looks like I'm not. Oh, I, oh, I got that coin in, in mid launch there. Alright. The first thing we want to do is jump on here so we can get this clock. You shall die! Get those star bits. Love star bits. One more for my one up. I get one up like a mad in this game. I have 24. Too bad I'm not gonna be able to keep them. Ooh, well that wasn't a good idea. Let's free this toad. And free that toad. And of course the red toad, you know, is back in the beginning. Scared out of its scared out of its mind. Red shell. Red Shell is just gonna kill these guys. You don't need to use the Red Shell, however. You know, you can use the Green Shell. Let's just break this, because I think that has our health extension. Get another Shell guy, because we need to kill the, uh... This guy. Can you get up there and hit him? Starve it. Wait, what? I didn't kill him? Apparently I missed. Well, that could explain why I'm missing. I'm... Okay. There he goes. Alright, so we're almost done here. Head up! And here we go, it's Camilla herself! The girl version of Kamek! You gotta love it! And there's our power star! She's using it for evil. Okay, so what I have to do is dodge her fire attacks. But when you see the green, just spin to it and you'll get the shell. Or you can wait till it's the ground and get the shell itself. Either way it works. Get those star bits, 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 blue star bits, gray star bits. So dodge the fire. And get the green. Oh, I did that too early. Not really that hard of a boss. Of course, I say that now, and then the next phase, I'm probably gonna die. Because he gets more upset. You know how there's always a cutscene, and they create more enemies for themselves. More Kamek that I'm just gonna kill right now. Though I love Kamek! Something I can really do here. Here, because I need to kill him. 
All right, let's go over here and you die. Two Kamaks at once. I jumped on the one and I threw the shell. And we were able to get the power star. All right, I'm just gonna leave that star there for one second because we have coins here that I want to mysteriously get. And that's just power jump, power jump, long jump into the power star. All right, and here we go. Looks like um, Rosalina has something to say. Uh, tell us as we get hit. As you reach rock, lucky number 13. Oh. It seems that a prankster comet has appeared somewhere. Hmm? Prankster comets have very strange effects on galaxies. If you want to learn more about those curious comets, ask the Luma who knows about such things. Which apparently is that pink one over there. Or purple. Purple, I want to say. I don't know why it's a pink when it's clearly it's purple. Alright, I, you know I think the pink is purple because the bottom looks like it's pink. Where is he? The bottom of him looks like he's pink, but the top looks like he's purple. Or is that red? Whatever, you know what, I'm not going to complain. But, before we continue on with Space Junk, if you notice the map... Okay, you know what, you're in the way. If you notice the map, there's a red comet here. I just threw a star bit at it. And that is here in... Good a, a Galaxy. In the Terrace. You can see that a red... Comet is in orbit, and it's the Speedy Comet. So let's do it. Let's do it. I have plenty of time to do this. Special since you gotta do it in a specific time limit in itself. Speedy Comet in orbit. I repeat, the Speedy Comet is in orbit. The Dino Piranha Speed Run. So pretty much you gotta speed run this mission, and that includes killing the enemy. So. Don't worry about- Now, any speedruns, don't worry about collecting star bits. And try to do any, like, series break type things you know. No! Uh, I didn't want to talk to him! Whatever, he did this thing for me, let's just go. Collect the star chips. Like I did before. Come on. Star chip right there. Come on, come on. Got it. I'm on two time limits right now, man. The mission time limit and the actual YouTube time limit. <laughs> Mid, come on! All right, I'm not gonna take the shortcut. I'm just gonna go the normal way. I know, I know. I have three minutes left, but in reality, I only have like a minute and a half. So this guy, I didn't show this before, but that's how you normally would get to that area. You must die! Okay, come on! Let's fly us to where we need to go. Boom! Mid star bit, man, look at that. It's trying to get to us, but it's not going to. Star bits is floating there, guys. And then he comes to us. Okay, let's quickly do this, because I don't have much time. I literally have like 30 seconds to kill this guy. Oh, come on, man. Yeah, I don't care about your, 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 your tantrum. I have 20 seconds, you know. So die so I can get the power star. No! That's it! Alright, he's dead. I did it with 206 remaining. Okay, considering that I passed the time limit, something's going to be sped up. Unfortunately. That's okay. I thought I would make it. But, oh, but time's still going. Alright, so. That's the speed run of this. Mission, which gives us a fourth star in Good Day Galaxy. All right, so that's obviously going to do it for this edition of Super Mario Galaxy. So this is Jersey Gamer Nine Thousand saying so long, everybody, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>